The farmer watched today as his livelihood went up in flames. The Gatineau blaze destroyed a major part of his business, killing nearly 50 cows. It broke out at the Scullion Farm located on Graber Boulevard near Monte Paymont just after midnight. CTV's Katie Griffin was there today and joins us live. Katie? Well, these were all dairy cows, and Derek Scullion was alerted to this blaze very early this morning by a good Samaritan who saw the flames from the road. Now, he knew that the barn was a total loss, so he was focused on trying to save as many cows as he could. On the farm that's been in his family for nearly 100 years, Derek Scullion surveys what's left after a barn housing dozens of cows was reduced to rubble. It's always a farmer's worst nightmare because once a barn starts to burn, usually everything burns. Just after midnight, Scullion was alerted to the blaze when a passerby drove up, flashing his lights and honking his horn. The smoke was too thick to get inside the first barn, so I found a way to get into the barn, opening doors. And I made my way to the second barn, and I could see that all the cows had died already. Scullion says 33 cows and 15 calves perished. Nearly 140 were saved. And I knew that it was time to concentrate on saving the rest of the barns and getting all the animals out. And the police and fire arrived, and my brother arrived, and eventually some neighbors arrived. And we were successful in getting 139 head out of the barns. There are four barns on this property. One of them was destroyed. Gatineau Fire says 15 trucks and 37 firefighters were on scene doing everything they could to stop the fire from spreading. The official cause of the fire hasn't been confirmed, but Scullion says he believes it was electrical, a ventilation motor from a fan. We're cleaning the barns out now and getting ready to put the cows back in. And the milking supplier is in and he has a plan to get the milking system going again. That passion for farming enabling him to keep going during a difficult time. Well, I'm a dedicated farmer, and yeah, I don't, uh, I don't doubt that I'm going to keep going. Scullion says he knew the neighbors who rushed in to help him, but he didn't recognize that good Samaritan who alerted him to that fire. So he'd like to meet that person to say thank you, because just by alerting them to that fire, uh, they all helped save a lot of cows today. Graham and Patricia. Thinking of that person despite everything he went mm -hmm. through today. Yes. All right, KCTV's Katie Griffin reporting live. Thank you, Katie. Welcome.